After the audit CA has finished all the uh, validation processes, uh, you will receive an email, or you have already received an email, that your certificate has been issued. This email looks like this. We are pleased to inform you, blah, blah, blah. Um, and you can download your certificate. In this video, we want to show you how to import the certificate into your existing key store that we have created previously with Keystore Explorer. And now we match the certificate with a private key. And then uh, we can transfer to the OFTP2 system that will use this uh, key pair for securing uh, connections to your business partners. We select the existing customer login now. You need to specify your email address. And hopefully you remember your password. And you see in the dashboard that the certificate uh, is ready for download. Click on download. You need to download three different certificates. The first one is the certificate of the ODET root. The second one is the certificate of the uh, or that issuing CA, and the third one is your own certificate that you use for the data exchange with your business partners. There are two different um, formats that the certificate can be provided in, the PEM format or the DER uh, uh, format. Uh, in most situations, the PEM format is the appropriate one uh, with a CER extension. Uh, can be used with many OFTP2 systems only if your OFTP2 system requires a DER, Distinguished Encoding Rules uh, um, uh, format, then select the um, DER format. And uh, some software systems only accept the DER extension. Therefore, we also provide the choice for DR extensions. In our case, we just use the PEM with a CR extension. Download the certificates. And again, I store all my certificates on the desktop. First, I downloaded the root. Uh, the issuing CA, then I download the root. And I download the user certificate. You can then log out and leave this application. The next step is to open our existing key store and to uh, import the certificates. Select tools, import trusted certificate and the first certificate to be imported is the root certificate. You will get this warning. Click OK and click OK once more. And yes, trust the certificate and accept this alias. Repeat. 
this procedure for the issuing CA. You don't get the security questions anymore because you already trusted the ODET root. Therefore, all certificates issued by the root uh, are trusted automatically. And finally, you import the CA reply. You select the key pair that we have generated uh, before and you import the CA reply which is our user certificate. And we have now added the uh, public key that has been signed by the ODET CA to the private key, uh, match them together, and uh, we can use this key pair for the data exchange with other partners. Save the changes and close the program.